Hi there, my name is Richard Steele and this is a continuation of my previous tutorials on the Sieg X2 Mini Mill. What I'm going to be showing you in this tutorial is how to protect the cables of your stepper motors. Okay, here we go then. You take your original stock um, NEMA 23 stepper motor then what you do is um, you have a small piece of rubber that protects the wiring where it goes into the stepper motor. You want to carefully remove that with a little blade, either that or unscrew um, the front and slide it off and take it out. It's probably easier just to cut it off though. What we're going to be using is we're going to be using flexible conduit. Um, this is the type of flexible conduit that we're going to be using. Um, it uses these kind of ends, which are snap-on ends. Um, you simply cut your conduit to length, your conduit pushes into the slot there, and you snap it closed on the end of your conduit. As you can see, that's got a thread on it. So what we're going to be doing, we're going to be... Um, gluing one of these nuts to the actual stepper motor and then that will then allow this to just screw into it so so that's what we started out with this is what you will end up with okay as you can see I've glued that on there that's solid um, you'd cable tie all your cable up, you'd extend it with whatever cable you're planning to use um, I've opted to use 5 core mains cable um, it's, it's nice and flexible it's not um, a solid kind um, so then what you do is you'd extend that, put it inside your conduit, cut your conduit, conduit to length and then all you simply do is it'll just screw on like that with your conduit on it and all your cable will be protected inside the conduit okay I'm not sure what size this conduit is but this um, fitting in here is an M20 fitting okay I hope somebody found this tutorial useful thanks bye for now